Well, here's our next project. Picked up a 1980 Kawasaki 440 LTD. Motor's locked up and carburetors are missing. But don't matter. We're going to pull all this off and convert it to electric. Pretty decent shape for as old as it is. It'll work for our purposes. Aluminum wheels. A decent rubber. Frames all solid. Everything's there that we need. The brakes work. Rolls nice and good. All the turn signals and everything's there. And a clear title so we can put it on the road. So I'm going to get it weighed first. Start off we know exactly what it weighs. Just the way it's sitting now. And then I'm going to pull off the motor and transmission and most of the other things that aren't needed. And then we'll see what it weighs. It's going to be fun. Now I took El Dingo for one last ride. Still don't steer with the shit. There's too much weight in the back. Now we're going to tear the Dingo down and get all the parts put on our bike there. First thing we can do is get the batteries and the controller and the motor off. Get the forward controls off. Or the forward control panel. And then we'll go from there. Well, so far I got the control box off. I got the forward control panel off. And hooked the foot pedals and everything. Got the control panel. Control panel sitting there, and the control box is here. Got the batteries inside on charge. Next, we'll get this motor off. I would think our motor would go roughly about right there. And we still got all the rest of the space for other stuff. back in there but about right down in there is where this center sprocket has to be 